Hello, it's Castaway Trader, and today I will be introducing to you my brand new trading view indicator. And I call this video Trading Magic Lines by WD Gun New Trading View Indicator. Before we start, please read that important disclaimer. Follow the Twitter channel to get slightly delayed trading signals. Okay, in this video we are going to talk about my brand new indicator that uses formulas created by a legendary trader WD Gan. That indicator for trading view calculates strong support zones based on the highest price reached at tops and strong resistance levels based on lowest price made at bottoms. In, I will show you a handful of examples where you will see why many traders believe that WD Gan was probably the most talented trader. So let's go to trading view and let's add that indicator. So to be able to use that indicator, you've got to be subscribed to my service and later in the video I'll show you how you can do that. And I offer my subscribers a number of proprietary indicators and I keep adding new ones. The indicator is called GANS Levels. So first, what indicator does, it automatically finds high and low pivots. Because the idea behind that method of GAN was that you can take price at the bottom and applying a formula, you would be able to focus where the next move up would top. And you can take price at tops and applying that formula, you will be able to calculate several levels where most likely price will find support. And I'm going to show you in this video how well that indicator and actually that formula works. So what we need to do to calculate potential resistance zones after that bottom was made, we click double times and we need to show resistance of low three. And you can see that the first resistance price went through it and started to consolidate. Then it came back down, found support twice and pushed to the next level. And this is exactly where it topped in mid-August 2022. To find potential support zone on the move down, we need to click it twice and we should click show support of high three, the half cycle down was 391.17 and this is exactly SPY found a strong support. So we can see that SPY actually tested that level four times and then it bounced up. We can also use a high price made at a lower high H1. To do that, we double click it and we should click show support of high one. And look, the first target was four 400.75 and this is exactly where price dropped to and found support. And look, that level precisely nailed the very bottom before a, a micro ABC move up and then it dropped again and look, last week it almost stuck 380.98, the half cycle down of the H1 high pivot. Let's look at the chart of SMH120, it's an ETF of semiconductors. And here we can see that based of H1 high pivot, we can calculate two potential support zones. One quarter of a cycle was 2 to 21.27 and we can see that price stopped for a second here, but then dropped again to the next half cycle potential support and this is where it found a strong support and it bounced back up. Let's see what po potential support levels we could get by taking into account that high. To do that we double click H2 and we click show support of high 2. We got a three quarter of a cycle stopping the decline and the strongest support was one cycle down and it precisely nailed the decline that took a month from the top at the beginning of June 2022 into the beginning of July 2022. But even that level at three quarter of a cycle, 
it nailed the bottom and it nailed a start of a pullback which actually came back up to the preceding uh, half cycle resistance so as you can see that according to GAN we can calculate those moves as um, cycle, half cycle, quarter cycle, three quarter of a cycle, full cycle or two cycles. Now let's check what levels of resistance we could calculate taking into account Z point L3, the low pivot. To do that we double click it and from the menu we pick show resistance of low 3. And again we see that the strongest levels are normally produced by three quarter of a cycle and the half cycle. And the half cycle almost nailed the top made in mid-August. Let's open QQQ. And again the indicator itself automatically identifies uh, those high and low pivots, those starting points for price projections. Let's start from L2 and let's calculate potential resistance levels of that level. We click L2 and we show show resistance of low 2. And we can see that a move up of L2 was exactly one half cycle and it topped where it was supposed to top at 314.69. You can also see that at three quarter of a cycle, we got 33260 end, and this is exactly where Q's topped in mid August 2022. If we calculate support zones of H1 high pivot, we will see that last week QQQ's stopped right at half cycle down of that H1 pivot. It's interesting that when we deal with corrective pullbacks, for example, like that, one quarter of a cycle levels often nail reversal points. Let's check it. Let's click H2 and we activate show one quarter of a cycle and we pick support of H2 and we got one quarter of a cycle. And this is exactly where price stopped. It made double bottom and started to go up again. Let's check GDX 120 minute chart. It's an ETF uh, which is composed of gold miners and let's see what kind of support levels we could calculate of that high pivot H2. We click H2 and we pick show support of high 2. You can see that that top was made in June and the low made in September was nailed by half cycle down of that top. If you switch to different time frame the ALGA would uh, identify different pivots. For example, if we switch to GDX daily, we will see much more important pivots. For example, let's check what kind of resistance level we could calculate based on that L1 low pivot. We click L1 and we click, we pick show resistance of low one. And look what we got. So half cycle up of L1 pivot nailed the top made in April 2022. Now let's check what kind of support levels we could calculate of that H3 high pivot. We click it and we pick support of high 3 and look what we got. First of all we see that the very first push down stopped right at half cycle down so it nailed the May low. Not only that, the 3 fourth of a cycle nailed the low made on July 25th and now it keeps bouncing along that level. Now let's click to futures and for example futures of crude oil and we can see that crude made an important top in mid-June 2022. So let's see what kind of support levels we could calculate of that level. We double click H3 and we pick show support of high 3. And look how beautifully that indicator worked on the chart. First of all, the very first move down stopped at half cycle down point. Then it made another lower low and stopped at three quarter of a cycle low. And another low was made right at one cycle down. It's purely amazing how one formula can calculate such precise levels of reversal.
we can also check what kind of support levels we could calculate of Z lower high point H2, we double click H2, we click show support F high 2, and look, Z low made in early September was actually nailed by half cycle down projection of point H2. I keep telling you that when you expect a pullback, so very often a pullback would stop at one quarter cycle up or one cycle down. So let's see a great example. Let's pick L1. Let's pick show one quarter of a cycle and let's pick show resistance of low one. Look, that pullback up stopped right at resistance that was at one quarter cycle up of L1 point. Let's look at chart of gold and you will see another great example how that rule of a quarter cycle pullback works. Let's pick L1 and let's show resistance of low one sh enabling show one quarter cycle levels. And you can see that gold popped once to one quarter cycle then dropped and then came back up again, tested it four times, failed and dropped down again. Let's see what kind of projections we could get from Z high labeled H3. We click H3, show support of high 3. And this is what we got. We got the first move down to one quarter cycle. It did not hold. You see it consolidated and then dropped to half cycle down. And that was a stronger bottom. And this is what I tell you all the time, so half cycle, three quarter cycle and full cycle are important support levels and important resistance levels. So look, it dropped to one quarter cycle, did not hold long, dropped to half cycle down, then bounced, then dropped again to three quarter cycle, bounced again and dropped again strongly to a more important, the full cycle down. In my opinion, it looks like magic. If we enable projections of H2 level, we can see that one cycle down was an important level and even months later price continued to respect that level. Let's open a chart of silver futures, daily time frame, and let's see what kind of support levels we could calculate of the top, which is labeled H3. We double click H3 and we pick show support of high 3. And half cycle down of that point exactly nailed that bottom, which was made on July 14th, 2022. And we got a big sizable pullback of L1. This is a chart of UVXI 240 minute. And I would like to check what kind of support levels we could calculate of the top labeled H3. We double click H3. We click show support of high three and we can see that it almost nailed the bottom made in June 2022 and then nailed the very bottom of UVXI made in mid-August 2022. It was three quarter of a cycle down of the top labeled HA3 and the preliminary, the first bottom was made almost at half cycle down. This is IWM ETF chart, 240 minutes, and I would like to check what kind of reversal levels I could find by taking into consideration that low labeled L as L3. I click L3, I click show resistance of low 3, and we can see that 3 quarter up of that low almost nailed the top made in mid-August 2022. Now let's check what kind of target for a move down we can calculate taking into consideration Z top labeled H2 we click H2 we click show resistance show support of high 2 and boom look that half cycle down nailed to the penny the law made in mid June 2022 now let's see what kind of support levels potential bullish reversal zones we could calculate taking into consideration the 
price at that h3 point we click h3 we click show support of high three and we got two levels and both levels work greatly you can see that half cycle down nailed the bottom made in early may and three quarter of a cycle down nailed the bottom made in may 2022 that new guns level indicator is available to subscribers of my monkeymakesmoney.com website where under subscription i offer a suite of proprietary trading view indicators including my best indicators that identify cycles in stocks and identify my multiple cycles and they print uh, alerts for multiple support and multiple bottoms all indicators are available under one subscription and i offer several options from monthly to quarterly and yearly and now i offer first 30 days of a monthly subscription for only 19.99 with a coupon trial and you have my 15 day money back guarantee and if you do not like those indicators please let me know and request the refund and within 15 days since you subscribe i will refund your money when you subscribe to any of those plans you will get access to my trading chart where you will see live alerts posted by both and my live comments about those alerts thank you for your time and follow me on twitter monkey makes money